Joe Sharp, nice win in the Rick Violet there. Uh, can you tell me a little bit about that that photo finish there? Can you tell me a little bit about the trip? It seemed like the horse was a little further back than it's normally. He was, you know, we obviously were, had a lot of faith in Flavian. He's a, um, you know, well accomplished rider, and uh, he made all the made the right all made all the right decisions. Um, you know, so with the soft ground, I think it was okay to be a little bit further back, and he just seemed like he was in a really good rhythm the whole way, and I think that really helped him have enough energy to finish with. Can you tell me a little about this claim, though? This uh, I believe this is the first claim for you from this owner. It was, yeah. I mean, Jordan and I have known each other since uh, worked for Maker years ago, and. This was the first horse he'd asked me to claim. Jordan picked the horse out, and we happened to be at the fairgrounds, right place at the right time. I believe we won a five-way shake for the horse. Um, but anyway, yeah, no, it's he's a horse that just kind of was real immature and has kind of continued to fill out and, and blossom and progress. And, you know, we're excited about where he's headed, especially being a three-year-old coming into the scene late in the year. So Seems like it's maturing at the right time. Are you going to spot it for something later in the Saratoga meet? Uh, you know, we'll just let him get cooled out. That was back in 20 days, which isn't normally our go-to. So uh, we're definitely going to let him get his air and get filled back out and rest up properly for his next start. Well, best of luck in the 10th race today as well. Thank you.